How do we conduct ourselves with one another and with the people in our lives? Paul makes the claim in his letter to the Corinthians that he and his fellow pastors have dealt with the Corinthians and the world in simplicity and sincerity. When Paul says that they have dealt with others in simplicity, he's not saying that what he's taught and done hasn't been complex or difficult to grasp. Rather, his claim is that their actions have not been duplicitous. Paul takes extreme care to explain his points in great detail, to teach with completeness, and to follow up on his teaching and discipleship with the new churches. He knows that the teaching he offers can be difficult and hard to accept. He is not making a claim that what he has offered is easy. He's saying that he has not offered his teaching with multiple motivations in mind. He has not been talking out of both sides of his mouth. He has not been telling the churches one thing while doing another. He has not been teaching some churches one gospel and others another. He is making a claim to consistent, singular conduct in his life, faith, and ministry for the gospel of Jesus Christ. Unfortunately, Christians have earned by our conduct a reputation that is almost the opposite of what Paul lifts up as the way we should be. We'll talk about each other. We judge other people outside of the church while preaching grace and try to undermine the ministry of the church when it isn't going how we want it to while paying lip service to our love of the church. May we commit ourselves to the example of Paul to conduct ourselves in simplicity and sincerity.